This is my 30th year uh, teaching young people how to start small businesses, and even more important, talking to young people about how to control their future, how to have a vision, how to learn basic skills that you can use in a marketplace to help other human beings and thereby help yourself, your family, and your community. I started in 1981, and I spent uh, almost seven years as a junior high, elementary, and high school teacher. My specialty was helping children that weren't doing well in school. Many times they had a reading problem, or their lives were marred by poverty or by tragedy, and helping them to find a niche, a comparative advantage that they could use in a marketplace. And after uh, seven years, I wanted to found an organization that focused on, on helping young people with their creative thoughts and turning those into a financial way to make a livelihood. My favorite story this year is of Rodney Walker. He took a nifty class when he was on the south side of Chicago in a school that uh, is one of Nifty's thousand schools around the world. And he had been homeless, he had been in foster care, uh, he failed out of school, and he uh, found his niche, which was small business and thinking about small business. And now I'm very proud to say he's at Morehouse, he's president of his class, and he's doing extremely well in school and giving back to his local community. We have a great partnership with MasterCard. What's impressed me about MasterCard is their focus and their knowledge in about small businesses and about the issues of financial inclusion. How do you get people that have been left out of a financial system both here in America and globally. How do you get them to be involved in the whole process of owning financial assets? Savings is our best chance to get people out of poverty.